Kobe, don't leave me. <laughs> Stick with me, please. I have to make things right. Fu Tang Dao Ho. Yes, but I'm scared. I have to tell you something. I love you too. This is what I was able to pull on Henry. This is what I was able to pull on Henry. Your father is Frank Blaze Andreas. You will never take him down by the book. When I arrest Henry, I'm going to put her in Kobe's cuffs. Yes, I will talk to the DA about a deal for you. Now shut up. Never seen anyone like you before. How are we going to keep this going if I don't know your name? I just had drinks with Henry. I'm doing my own undercover operation. She got a short fuse. She doesn't know me. She knows you. She wants to see me again. Okay. Next time you call me, we do it together. Are you listening to me? Together. Taking Henry and BMF down will at least give us some peace. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Mark Dark, and I'm back with another video. If you're new, if you love BMF, go ahead, hit that subscribe button, like the video, and leave your theories, comments, everything down below. Now today, we're gonna be talking about BMF season three. Is this the end for Veronica Jen, or will she end up taking Henrietta down? I want you guys to leave your predictions down below on this storyline. We know things are heating up, with Veronica Jen and Henrietta and of course Detective Bryant. But man, it seemed like something major is about to pop off within the last three episodes. So we're going to talk about those predictions in this video. Now you guys, make sure you check out my last video. I dropped the what to expect for episode eight. We're going to see how Meech is going to deal with this problems with Glock and being back in Atlanta. And we're also going to see what Terry's going to be on. How will he handle this Vince character and you know all the drama with Markeisha. Now, Let's talk about the topic of discussion. Detective Veronica Jen, we know she wants payback. We know she lost her partner, Detective Amberson, in episode five. I mean, a lot of bodies was getting dropped off. Unfortunately, Detective Amberson was one of those bodies. But now we know Veronica, she wants to play with fire. This is what she told her pops. She understands that she's not gonna let this go and she has to get, you know, Henrietta up out of here somehow some way and she's risking her life by doing this right now we know when they start showing a character's story a lot more especially a character that they don't normally show like that usually they're setting up this character to go and this is in a lot of tv shows they like to give us more of a backstory build up that character and then they drop them off now sometimes in these stories they like to build up these characters and then we see like a major character development arc like we're seeing right now with Veronica Jen. And sometimes these characters do end up surviving. Now the question is, will Veronica Jen be one of those characters that survives or will she be on the other side and will she end up getting dropped off? I'm gonna tell you right now, it's not looking too good for Veronica Jen because she's up against a whole lot, right? A whole lot. Now we know if Blaze finds out about Veronica Jen, it's over for her. Some of you guys did bring that up that maybe, you know, Henrietta has her around or somehow, some way her pops finds out about Veronica Jen. I mean, that's one way, right? But what about Lenny Edwards, right? This is the guy that Veronica told they're going to help set him up a deal so he can be protected when it's all said and done. But what if Henrietta questions him and then this dude says, you know what? You know, Veronica, she's an undercover. She is trying to set you up. What if that happens? Which it could, right? Now, what about what Detective Bryant told Veronica? He said, you know what? Be careful. The next time you go in, please let me know. We need to do this together. You should not be going in alone. As whether he's going to be sitting outside or something. He just wants to be there just in case something pops off. And then Veronica had that funny look on her face like, okay, we're going to do it together. Now, what if she's not telling the truth? And she ends up going in by herself risking her life once again with no type of backup, no type of help. That's going to end very bad for her, especially if Henrietta finds out what she's really on. And if Veronica is taken out by Henrietta, we know your boy Brian, he's going to be even more upset. He's already pissed off about the whole Kevin thing. He tried to go at Henrietta, but we know her popped. 
he ended up giving him, you know, a pass on that and let him go. But now what's going to happen if she's taken out? Your boy, Brian, he's already on demon time. He, you know, he kind of calmed down last episode a little bit, but he will turn up once again. But the sad thing is he's already warned Veronica, do not do this alone. Be careful. It's a very high risk, right? And we know taking down her in her pops blaze will be very difficult. Now, she's not really too concerned about taking out Blaze. She just wants to get payback on Henrietta. And the things that she is doing is putting herself at a very high chance of being taken down. So, we're going to find out, man. Now, a lot of the fans, they want Henrietta up out of here. You know what I'm saying? Because Henrietta, she be turning up. She be doing a whole lot. Flame Thors, I mean, catching bodies. She's moving very reckless. Like I told you guys, it makes all the sense in the world why her father Blaze treats her the way he treats her as far as running the organization and making certain decisions. He ain't having it. It's a high risk by having her around. We saw what she's done, you know, taking out cops. You can't do that. That's messing up business and it makes everything a tad bit too hot, right? Now, Veronica Jen being a cop, that actually may be some insurance for her because we already know that Blaze, he doesn't want that type of heat. He ain't trying to take out no cops. And he's already warned his daughter not to do this. So if she goes and she does it again without his approval, I can see some more drama popping up within the family. As I always told you, I believe it will be a major family clash between the two. And this whole Veronica Jen thing, it could, you know, shake up the story a tad bit more. But we're going to find out soon enough. But I want you guys to leave your theories, predictions. Leave it all down below. Y'all let me know exactly what you think is going to happen within this whole storyline. Could this really be it? For Detective Veronica Jen, or will she end up getting the victory and beating Henrietta somehow, some way? Well, we're going to find out. Now, I want to thank you guys once again for all the love, all the support, and I will catch y'all on the next one. But let me get up on out of here, man. It should be more dark. I'm out. Peace.